dead death. I hate you. But you can't. As a basketball player, you don't want to look like no upside down bowling pin. <laughs> Be big up top, little at the bottom. Look like, come on, man, Johnny Bravo. <laughs> like a whole bunch of Johnny Bravos on a basketball court. Don't look like that. Don't take that long. You ain't got to be in the gym for two hours. Get it in and get it out. Don't poop around. Get it done. Get the work done. In here, boom. Right back. Wake up in the morning. Get it in. Early morning. Six o'clock. Get it in. Get a nice little smoothie in. Weight room. Gym. Come back. Eat a big breakfast. Lay down. Relax for a little bit. They do it all over again later on in the afternoon. That's how we get it. jump shots one two dribble pull-ups you know what I'm saying you should be able to be effective and three dribbles or less if you're really good you could do stuff off of one or two dribbles but it's just, just about getting the spots understanding where he's at on the floor what things you can go to it's always a counter in every move I don't care what nobody say there's a counter to every move in the game of basketball they take this away if you got the proper footwork you can get away you know what I'm saying it's always an escape for something not necessarily mean if you're trying to score and you're stuck, you know, your footwork can get you out of a lot of situations, not necessarily to actually shoot the ball, but for your teammates. So that's what we're just working on, getting him ready for the pro game, keeping the game simple. The pro game, you gotta be able to shoot. You gotta be able to pass with your left and your right hand. You gotta understand the game. You gotta be able to dribble. 
you know, decent. You know what I'm saying? If you have elite handle ability, that's good, but you just gotta be able to handle the ball to the point where you can get to your spots. You know, in the European game, I mean, you know, some guys are very slow, but they're deceptive with it. They understand angles, how to use their body. You know what I'm saying? How to come off of ball screens, how to come off of down screen, pin downs. Just knowing how to create the proper separation. So that's all, that's what we're working on. You know, we're not doing anything extravagant. Twitter or YouTube or Instagram or whatnot. Getting the right work in. Part of any sport, the most conditioned athletes are, tend are the ones that tend to last the longest. So uh, this is Josh, what, third, fourth workout of the day. You know, in the morning we get it in, lift, then we go to the gym, go do some skill work, then we go back home, eat, relax, kind of decompress a little bit, you know, chill out, go back to the gym, get more shots up, and now we're here in the afternoon, get it in in the heat. You know, challenge yourself a little bit. Not gonna kill himself because it's hot out here, but you know, getting this good mile in and that's gonna be it for the day. Way to get it done. Uh.